Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another Polybius tutorial on uh, Q software by Corsair Gaming. I actually have a subscriber asking a question and I wanted to answer it for him because I uh, actually found it out. He asked how to basically make ones or one key repeat itself. So he, he used the example for the number one and I have it working right here. Um, it's called one hold repeat. This is my macro and uh, this is what it does. So I'm going to go over to this notepad. He wants them to uh, repeat uh, instead of having to click every time to insert them. So I'm going to show you how to do that. But I'm going to show you that it actually works first. So um, as I press in the number 10 on my scimitar, which is uh, currently bound to the macro, uh, take a look at the notepad and watch this. I'm holding in the key and it's generating infinite m number ones. So, you can hold it, as, hold it in as long as you like and stop it as soon as you let go. It's pretty easy. So, I'm going to show you how to make this. Uh, first off, let's take a look at what I did to make the number one repeat. Um, all I, I I started the naming convention how I usually do it. Uh, the key, the type of um, either pressing or, or I'm sorry I'm holding or you know clicking once, and then I added another that says repeat for like an extra little special thing that it does. Because I I usually don't use this kind of macro very often, but I would like to share the world how to do this because they have questions. So what I do is um you press the key uh once and in the macro and then you hit execute macro inter uninterrupted and uh while pressed and then the constant millisecond so this is how fast it's going to go so i'm going to show you how to make this macro from scratch let's go to actions new and we'll name it two hold um, and we'll call it repeating because we're actually going to make this thing repeat. Uh, notes. I always organize my notes, so I'm going to put hold repeat. It makes it much easier to search for when you're looking for macros as you look at my list over here. Um, so what we're going to do is hit the record button and we're going to press 2 on the keyboard and hit stop. Now what I usually do is take out the delays, so you can hit either clear delays or you can go here and press delete and I'll just hit clear delays, it's pretty easy. Go ahead and hit OK and we will check out some other settings we have here. Now what my subscriber is asking is to repeat and down here is a section that lets you uh, toggle a repeat option. So he's wanting to press down on the key and have these numbers infinitely flood in for as long as you hold it. So we want to select while pressed. And the constant, you can make it as fast as you want up to uh, uh, down to one millisecond I suppose. For uh, purposes here we'll use three millisecond timer. The uh, lower it is the faster it will go. So what we will do now is simply hit OK. I think that's all we do. Um, that yeah I, Here's where he's asking to hold it in because the macro termination will execute uninterrupted. Uh, we don't want to select ter terminate when pressed again. We don't want this option nor this option either. We only want one macro. So with all these settings in place, we should be able to answer our fan mail. And we will go over to, actually let me show you this. Uh, we'll go into our notes, uh, sort by notes, and you'll see that um, I have one hold repeat and two hold repeat right here. So this is the one we want to assign to our scimitar. So we'll go over to profiles, and uh, we'll, we'll select uh, key 11 just to show you guys. You can pick anything you want, of course. So we'll sort by notes if we can. We can also type it in. So it's two, and then hold and then repeat. So it's right here. Uh, we'll click OK. Actually, 
wait a minute, is this it? Yeah, two, hold, repeat. Don't pick this one, I made this one earlier uh, to show, to make, be like, to practice before I recorded. So pick this one. It's the hold, repeat, the one that I just made, and it will be assigned to 11. So let's go into a notepad or whatever you want and go ahead and execute that by holding in 11. And it will repeat. And you let go. And repeat, let go. Repeat, let go. And that's it. That's it. that's about as easy as it gets, guys. Um, if you thought this was helpful, please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, follow me on Twitter. And uh, I will hope to hear back from you about other questions you might have with Corsair, because I'd like to figure them out myself. It's kind of like a puzzle. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. This has been Polybius, and I'm going to go.